My name is Matt McLean. So I lead the Annapurna customer engineering team. So my team essentially help uh, customers adopt AWS Trainium and, and Friendship for their workloads. So yeah, so I work for AWS. I've actually been working for AWS for more than 11 years now. And I've been working in the Annapurna and AWS Trainium team for a couple of years. And how I take my coffee? Well, my wife's Italian, so I prefer to take it in Italy and in, uh, in a, a cafe place uh, with Italian coffee is how I prefer it. Hello, my name is Kamran Khan. I lead our business development and go-to-market uh, teams around Infrench and Trainium. And I like all types of coffee. So generally, I'll take a, at home, I'll make myself a flat white. And on the go, I like a variety of kind of light to medium roast uh, drip coffees. Yeah, so maybe I can kind of explain the difference between Infrench and Trainium. So essentially at the accelerator level, it's basically the think of basically the same they have for the you know the each uh, accelerated chip has two neuron cores so you can kind of think of a neuron core a little bit like a gpu so an inference so inference is is essentially a it can be deployed in more uh, regions it has lower power requirements because it has less chips so in training we have 16 accelerators whereas in inference we have 12 also, the network connectivity between the instances. So we're using e networking between the instances. So in training, we have up to 1600 gigabits per second network connectivity, whereas in inference, we don't need, you know, typically when you're doing inference, you don't need this high speed, high bandwidth networking connectivity between the instances. So it's uh, only 100. So yeah, so inference is, is also a cheaper instance option. But you can actually train on inference, which is interesting. And then you can actually do inference on Trainium. So yeah, I know it's a little bit confusing, but the yeah. levels of the- Just to make it easy yeah. for everybody. <laughs> uh, but it, are there people doing a lot of that? Like just because you can doesn't mean you should, right? Are there people that yeah. are doing it? So there are. So as I mentioned, so for, for customers who want to deploy large LLMs, you know, like Llama 3, 17B, you know, so when you're getting into sort of towards the 100 billion parameter models, actually training is actually a better, better choice. Sure.